The trouble with travel tripods is that whilst they fold up really small, they don't do very much. And they certainly don't hold very much. Until now, that is. Most travel tripods run from 1.3 to 1.5 meters tall. So wouldn't it be nice, just for once, to have a travel tripod that ran over two meters? That's right, seven feet. And I know what you're thinking. What kind of an idiot runs a travel tripod at over seven feet with anything more than a compact camera on it? We can't think of everything. Caca! Caca! So if you can't run it at seven feet with anything more than a compact camera on it, what's the point? Bottling could be hard. But not when you're working with a pro. Oh, uh, work it, Troy. Oh, that's good. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, work it, Troy. Oh, you're gorgeous. Like most travel tripods nowadays, it comes with a detachable monopod. But wouldn't it be nice, on the odd occasion, if you were able to go to a second camera without having to put it down on the floor? Wait, I need to get closer. The problem with very tall tripods is that they come with their limitations. I mean, what's the use of having a seven foot tripod if you need to be five inches off the ground? Is that even possible? Let's be honest, size does matter. I mean, some guys can only dream of five inches. Macro photography is my passion. Being able to get down to five inches really helps me photograph my one favorite subject, wildlife. Work it, Troy. Oh, you're a beautiful turkey. I've never seen such gorgeous nasal hair. Give us a gobble. Gobble, gobble. Oh, I love it. The three-legged thing, X1.1 Brian. Winner of the Innovative Imaging Product of the Year, 2013. The world's most capable and functional travel tripod. Isn't it time your tripod made more sense? <laughs>